guys welcome to today's video so today we're doing a uh, jewelry collection and how I organize my jewelry so obviously I have a new room so I have a new way that I organize my jewelry um, in my drawers behind me so I'm gonna show you guys that in a little bit but I wanted to do a video like this and just show you guys how I organize my jewelry where I got my organizers from and kind of show you um, my favorite pieces of jewelry and stuff that I like to wear most of the time and where I get my jewelry from and all that stuff because I really like watching these and I like watching um, different places I can get jewelry from because there's so many different places you can literally get jewelry from now um, and there's so many different brands and I love watching these and just seeing the different types of pieces and like different types of big necklaces and dainty necklaces and all that. But I really hope you guys enjoyed this video. Don't forget to give it a thumbs up and subscribe and turn on the bell notification so you don't miss a video. I'll show you guys where these are from. The jewelry piece is from uh, Zara, I think. Um, I got it like a while ago and these are from, from Honey, I think, which is a store. I'm not sure if it's like international, um, but we have it in Toronto. Um, it's from Honey, I think. Maybe it's from, from another store. You can find gold hoops literally anywhere. So those are the two pieces I'm wearing. Let's move on to the fun part. Hey guys. Uh, welcome to the angle of my beautiful jewelry. Um, so I have two drawers of these. I'll show you guys the second one after but this is the first drawer So this is where I keep some hoops um, I just like to place them like this and then I have just like little little dainty necklaces that are like super soup Like look how small they are like and dainty. So I just like to keep these in here um, I really wish I had cute nails right now, but I don't so we're gonna have to deal with this these, these uh, Organizers that I'm showing you guys are all from Amazon. I will link them down below I hope they're still available, but they're really nice and let me show you guys uh, They're kind of like a velvet material like they're really soft and nice um, and they are just like a nice space to put your jewelry. I have like some jewelry boxes down here um, Or back here that I just like to keep in case like I travel or something. Oh, so, let's go over it I have just like these little dainty uh, Gold necklaces. This one says my name on it. It says Gabriella. It's all tangled um, I have this one that I got from Mykonos. This is one that uh, me and all of my best friends have We all have a necklace like this um, and Paige and I got them for all my all our best friends little diamond uh bracelet situation it's super cute and like nice and simple it just adds something to like a nice look plain necklace but it has my letter in arabic um it's super cute i got it from lebanon uh, a while ago i think i'm not sure when i got it like stuff that like means stuff to me from people that like i love and that i care about so this is like that section i have this necklace, this is a gold necklace. I've had it for so long. It's a cross necklace and then it comes with the chain. The chain is tangled. I really need to just untangle these. Usually they don't get tangled, but now they are. Um, so I just like to put that there. And then I have this little uh, bracelet. I'm really not sure when I got this, probably when I was a lot younger, but it's a diamond bracelet. And it's really, really cute and nice and dainty. I actually love this bracelet. I have this rosary. Oh my god, it's tangled. I can't. Oh my god. It's just like this rosary that I got from Lebanon like a lot of years ago. Um, and it's just a really beautiful rosary. And it has like a pearl detailing here. And I like to keep that. I have a lot like of crosses and rosaries and stuff. This one that I got from Lebanon this year when I went. Or last, or last summer. Um, so this is a gold necklace what the heck why is it like this oh okay so this is what it looks like it's like this oh it's like this and it's kind of like a double layered type of thing so it just looks like this and then it just has like these beads that are actually super beautiful i love them we have my my one and only necklace that i literally wear all the time like if you know me you know that literally i live in this necklace um it's real gold so i take a shower with it i do everything with it um it's my name in arabic so this says gabriella in arabic and it's such a beautiful necklace i got it from my mom got it for me actually from lebanon um when i was like in grade nine or something so it's been some years um but it's still like perfect i have my three hoops so i have these ones these are probably from i don't know where they're they're kind of like rusted now but you know i still have them big hoops you know love that then i have these chunkier hoops that are from zara so this is what they look like um they're really cute but they're a little bit heavy on my ears honestly um so i don't wear them as often but they're really cute hoops they're just nice 
a little bit thicker, a little bit nicer, more bulky. These are um, earrings that my aunt got me like a few years back for Christmas. Um, they're from Michael Hill, I think, and they're like these silver hoops. They're little hoops. You guys have definitely seen me wear these before, but I love these hoops. They're so, so cute and adorable, um, and I love wearing them. So then back here, I have this chunky chain, um, and I love this jewelry piece. Uh, I can't remember where this is from, but you can find chains like this anywhere. Like they really sell them like pretty much. I think this is from M. Uh, if you guys are from Toronto, it's from M. Um, but I got it like a few years ago or maybe like last year. I don't really remember, but this is just a really nice little necklace or actually, no, I got this back in like October or something. I don't even know. And then I have this watch, which my cousin got this for me for my sweet 16 which was so many years ago, but it's this Michael Kors watch. I don't wear it as much anymore, but I used to literally go to school every single day with it. Like I could not leave the house without this watch. Um, you know, it doesn't even work. It's a nice sparkle to it. Oh my God, I love it. I really want to get a nice out like silver watch, but you know, that's expensive. So yeah, but I really love this watch. It has a lot of meaning to it. So. I will forever have that watch. And then I have my two pieces from Lolita. So this is the first one. This is the Gucci link that I have. I usually, I wore it in my Toronto Man's Do My voiceover video. And shout out to you guys, because you guys love that video. But so this is the piece that I wore in that. Um, it's a really nice piece. Um, it's really nice and like thick and it's like good material it's like good quality i just love lolita because they actually have such good quality things so i love this piece i just put it like this fits perfectly it doesn't get ruined or tangled or anything and then i have my cuban link that i also got from lolita a while ago so this is what it looks like it's kind of like a choker um and it's really nice and look how sparkly it is so pretty um and these are both gold um because i'm pretty sure they were sold out of the other ones but they just have like two clasps here to attach to the necklace when you put it on. Um, so these are my two Lolita pieces, my bigger chains. Um, I do plan on getting more chains, but you know, for the time being, this is what I have. So here we have the next drawer. So these are part of the first set. So these are actually like the top, like they're supposed to go on top, but I separated them. So this is the next drawer. So it has three little dividers. So let me show you them one by one So this is the first one. This is for necklaces So it has these little hooks at the top that you just like put your necklaces on um, So this is the first piece um, This is a cedar and it has diamonds on it. It's from Lebanon I have a lot of jewelry from Lebanon and then the second one is this piece. I wore this a few videos ago um, and it's from Swarovski, I think. I've had it for so, so long, but it's a little apple. Look how cute it is. I love it. It's so cute. And then I have this one. I think this is also from Swarovski. Oh my God. This is a little lock with a key. Oh my God, look how cute. I love dainty jewelry. Um, and then I have this piece. I think this is from tiffany i didn't even i forgot because i haven't worn it i literally have outworn it um it actually rusted a lot which i'm really surprised for something that's from tiffany but this is a heart necklace it's actually super cute i just don't wear it anymore because it is really rusted but i keep it because it was a gift and i love it and then this is the last one where is this from i have no idea where this is from but it's like a little crown oh my god look how cute wait focus Look how cute! It's so cute, I love it. I actually do have room for one more, but I don't have one right now. But yeah, so it has one, two, three, four, five, six at the top, so you can hang or you can overlap them if you have more, obviously. So that's the first little organizer, I love it. So this is the second one. So in here usually goes the chain I'm wearing right now, but I'm wearing it. So this is the second organizer. So this is what it looks like. It's just has little different compartments in it. It's really cute and really good to organize. So I'm gonna go through it one by one. This is the first piece. So this is actually the matching. Oh, where did you come from? This is a little layered necklace. So this is also from Michael Hill. It's literally the matching necklace to the earrings. Um, so it was a gift from my aunt a few years back. Oh my God, why am I struggling? So basically you attach it like this and it looks like this. It's like a layered necklace. It's so pretty and shiny. Um, it's actually so beautiful. I always wear it. And it's just like a nice dainty simple necklace and I really, really love it. 
this is the next bracelet I have. Um, this is a dolphin bracelet, super freaking cute. Tell me, okay, I love dolphins. If you know me, you know I love dolphins. This was a gift and I love this so, so much. So I have it in here. I don't know where it was supposed to be, but you know, it got lost in the sauce, but here we are. Okay, so then the next piece is this Nike necklace. This is from Lolita and this is just a Nike Nike chain necklace um, and it came in gold, but they only had silver left I would have gotten it in gold because I have more gold jewelry, but it's what it looks like. It just says Nike Has a little uh, check mark really really cute that piece. Um, I really love this chain I wear it with like a lot of different outfits if a Nike outfit. Ooh, so cute So this is from Lolita because you know you, as you can tell I love their stuff and then I have a Pandora bracelet. So this is the red um, chain Pandora bracelet. Um, it's like the red leather. I'm not sure if they sell this anymore, but it has so many different charms on it. Um, it has just like so many different charms. It has um, one from Mykonos that I got. I have one. Oh, this one's like little mittens. So cute. This one's a gift one that I got for Christmas a few years ago. Um, this one's a cupcake because I love to bake. This one's a turtle. Um, this one is from London. Oh, I just keep that in here. So cute. Um, continue to collect my Pandora charms. Another necklace. I'm pretty sure this is from Swarovski. It's a diamond, uh, little pink heart. And it's so cute. And it has a little butterfly. Oh, wait, can you see? It has a little butterfly over here. I feel like... When I wear this, I would change out the um, band that comes with it. This is like a brown, um, it's kind of like a, a leather, not a leather, it's like a, a rope kind of thing, but it still looks really cute and I love this, it's so cute. Chain that I think I stole from my sister, I have no idea where it's from, but it's just like a really cute gold chain. I wear it sometimes, I don't think she knows I have it, so now she knows. Um, this is another thing I have from Lolita, this is my initial. Um, I think this is called the classic initial or something like that. I'm gonna show you guys. Look at the inside. It's all sparkly. Uh, so, so cute. I got this right before my birthday and I treated myself to this um, and some other jewelry pieces. And yeah, so I got this um, and it's super cute. I like to wear it with a lot of different um, outfits and stuff. This one, this one, I have no idea where this is from. And it's all tangled. So, love that for me. But this is just uh, so tangled, don't look at it. But it's just like this um, purple butterfly um, and it has diamonds on it. It's so, so cute. And I need to really sit down and untangle these. It's just cause like we haven't gone out in so long. So when am I gonna wear them? I don't reach for them. And they just got like tangled, you know, lost in the sauce and tangled. So I have to untangle these, but look how beautiful this is. It's so pretty. Moving on to the last section, which is this one right here. So this is all my uh, rings and earrings, um, like stud earrings. So I have these three earrings right here. So I have these ones, these ones, and these ones. These are all from Winners. Um, Winners has some great uh, jewelry section if you guys have a Winners where you live. And then I have these ones. These are from Pandora and super cute i have this bracelet this is from my aunt she got it for me a few years back and i just have it like this because more of like a bangle so it kind of like sits up so i just put it like this and it fits like perfectly rings are actually all stacked and obviously you like put them on different fingers but let me just show you guys them on one finger so like you can put this on i would put this on one finger and this these on one finger and then this on another and they kind of just go together. So um, I honestly hate wearing rings without having nails. So this is like not my thing right now. But when I have nails again, obviously I will wear the rings. But until then, I'm not going to wear rings because I really just don't like my fingers. So yeah, so these are the rings. I just put them all separately because you can just wear them all separately. But that's how they look stacked. Obviously, you don't put them all with the same finger because it's hectic. But you know, if maybe if that's your style, do what you got to do but I think it just looks too hectic, especially my fingers because they're so small and stubby. Um, and then I have this ring, this is from Pandora. I got it like so long ago. And then I have this, this is a uh, initial. So this is my initial in Arabic. It's a little gold ring. It's super cute. It's also from Lebanon. Um, and then I have my birthstone. So this one for November. And then I have this little ring. Um, I forgot when I got this, but it's so cute and dainty. 
Um, like I said, you know, it looks ugly without nails. So I won't be wearing rings now. And then I have this ring from Pandora and this one, I have no idea what it is, but look how small it is. I think it's from when I was like a baby or something. I don't know, but it's just a ring. And then this is another ring that I have. Um, this is probably the most meaningful ring that I have and I love it so much. And, um, I hate my fingers without nails. Like I can't. So this is my little section and, um, that's pretty much how I organize my jewelry. So got the drawer here and the drawer here. Um, and yeah, that's pretty much it and how I organize my jewelry. So guys, that is it for today's video. I really hope you guys enjoyed watching my jewelry collection. Um, my hands smell like jewelry now, you know what I mean? Um, so I'm gonna go wash my hands, but I really hope you guys enjoyed this video. Don't forget to give it a thumbs up and subscribe. I'll try to link everything that I can down below if I can find the item or whatever. Um, I'm sure Lolita still has all the stuff that I mentioned unless it's sold out. But yeah, that's pretty much it for today's video. I hope you guys enjoyed and I will link the organizers too down below. Hopefully you can still find them. So that's kind of how I organize my jewelry. I wanted to show you guys and my jewelry collection so i really hope you guys enjoyed and don't forget to give this video a thumbs up and subscribe for more collection videos and i will see you guys in my next video bye